First, we're going to check out the museum. a nice tour of Ishimche, which means three corns. Lots of temples to check out here. That take you around, but yeah. So These are public baths and a public water tank, still in use for washing clothes. Lunch, we're gonna try something traditional. Traditional dish of Antigua, chicken. Oh, that's the one that you were talking about. Exactly. Yeah, this is the Antigua. Your sides? I recommend you rice for that. little bit of rain but honestly it's barely stronger than a sprinkle it's not really raining out at all it rains for about maybe 40 minutes an hour and then it's done so September is still a pretty nice time to visit Guatemala just prepare for a little afternoon rain just a little bit
Now, is this actually supposed to be the Last Supper or just? It is the Last Supper. It is the Last Supper, okay. Of course, there is a, a cemetery today, but it's not from that time. So we just finished the day in Antigua. Antigua was really fun. But we've got to get packed because pickup for Tikal tomorrow is super, super early. Pickup is literally at 4.30 a.m. So I'm going to get packed for these two days and try to get a shower and lay down because I'm probably going to get up about 3.30 or so just to make sure I have everything and I'm ready. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Airport is rough, like rough. Uh, just get to our flight, get to our gate. This is they got us in the ghetto. For real. My ride is here. Let me show you guys. This is gonna be our ride to Flores from Guatemala City. So uh, it's about 5:40 right now. So. We're gonna hop on this plane. Let's get going. See you soon, Tikal. We have landed. It's super green here in Flores. So now we'll get our bags and then wait for our ride. Tikal, Tikal. So after a quick little breakfast, we're gonna get ready to hop on in the van. They're about ready to go, so I put my shoes on now, my sneakers for hiking, so we're ready to go. So all right, let's get ready to check out Tikal. It's about an hour drive out, they said, so it's gonna be a little bit ways, but we'll check out the scenery before we get there, and then we'll be in the rainforest and ready to go. All right. moments later so we got caught by a little bit of rain but it's okay because we were prepared for this 
I have my poncho and my umbrella just so my cameras didn't get wet, but it's only gonna last for a few minutes and it should be gone. Okay, the room here is pretty cute. It's a nice little cabin with a cute lake view. Let's see what's over here. This is really cute. It's like a little. Honestly, for the value with the tour, this is a super cute room. destroying this you know because the roots goes into the, the roots lines, yeah you know, and that's one of the issues that we have and uh, this is so this is what they use for their calendar growing calendar done by local people that's pretty that's probably a good idea yeah and, and the idea or the whole concept in Tikal is that the park create jobs you know for watermelons yeah at the end.
Now, what is this one called again? Mm -hmm. um, the name of this is Kakik. 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 It's Maya. Means spicy soup. But it's not spicy. Generally, it's, it's, it's done with turkey, but in this case, uh, we with go chicken. for chicken. Okay. okay. And then Where is the Quetzal bird, which is a bird that represents our freedom. The father represents the ocean, the white represents We have landed back in Guatemala City. Oh, thank God it was raining. It was ooh, a hell of a flight. Oh, we made it back. In gratitude of Guatemala. Okay. And here's our ride to Hopi Tantango. for second time this year. Now I am a archaeologist. <laughs> Cause you see through my disguise See right through me You will see who I am for real See right through me for real See who I am for real uh, For real uh, For real uh, Thank you. 
It's always easier to tell you lies Let it show for your surprise You see me as Mr. Right What of advice, change your mind Cause you're blind I go for you here yeah. Cutest vibes ever This mountain is the name Cerro Chino. Déjame, déjame llegar que le tengo que hablar. Yo no le quiero poner inmobiliaria, pero eh, podemos ver. No sé si real estate o cualquier. Cosa. Oh no no no, you're okay. Resting a little marshmallows. Vamos a continuar por este, este lado. Tiene mucho cuidado de no resbalarse yeah. y vamos para abajo donde están los toldos. <risa> Pollo Campero. That's like the fried chicken of Guatemala. So let's see how it goes. I just got a thigh because I wanted to, you know, see what the hype was about. But let's see if it's as good as they say. So I finished. So my verdict is it's not bad. It's actually pretty decent. I put it like above KFC, but not as good as Popeyes. Kind of like a really good grocery store or gas station fried chicken I mean as far as fast food fried chicken goes it's actually pretty decent I got the thigh it was really juicy it was seasoned well so okay pollo campero I, I think I get it but again it's fast food fried chicken so we're not gonna give it that much but it was pretty decent ready to head to Atitlan so let's hope it's not a long drive or no traffic so we started on the three and a half hour drive to Lake Atitlan and let's just say it was more than worth the journey I really hope you play this cause oh girl you test my patience with all these seductive photographs and all these one-off vacations you've been taking